At the Alzheimer's Disease and Memory Disorder Center at Rhode Island Hospital, they're having quite the impact. We provide uh, diagnosis and cares and counseling and also uh, research op op opportunities and uh, uh, most uh, uh, update uh, treatment options. The center is nationally recognized for both its clinical services and clinical trials that offer the latest in new therapies. Ryan Hospital uh, Alzheimer's Center actually is uh, fun, uh, longer than uh, pioneer in this uh, field. Currently, there are no approved treatments to stop the disease, but there are promising experimental treatments to slow its progression, and they've made great strides in diagnosis. We can actually diagnose disease much better and only more accurate now. That's our major achievement in the past 20 years. Thanks to important breakthroughs, the PET scan to measure changes in the brain and better understanding of two proteins in the brain, amyloid and tau, that are linked to this memory-robbing disease. The center's director, Dr. John Wu. Hopefully in the future, a simple blood test will help us to learn what's changed the brain and uh, that can also guide us for treatment. Rhode Island is a unique community in which to study Alzheimer's because of its small size and aging demographic. Currently, volunteers age 50 plus can sign up for the Rhode Island Alzheimer's Disease Prevention Registry to take part in current and planned studies. Uh, benefit for uh, uh, people will know when this may start it early, and uh, uh, it also provides a platform for research and uh, to develop a new testing and treatment. Early diagnosis is key to preserving brain function before it's lost, hoping to make Alzheimer's a disease people can live with. Uh, such as uh, treating cholesterol or diabetes. So that's our goal in the near future.